peace be with you welcome back to my channel for another video another spiritual download if this is the first time that you are coming across my channel let me be the first to say i'm so happy to see you congratulations you know why because you listen to your instincts you followed the yellow brick road and you listen to your intuition it's never guided you the wrong way listen here's the catch though you know there's something here that you need to know that you already know that you know you know. You just need more confirmation, right? You've already made some type of determination about a situation, but it really is nice just to keep that clarification on the table, isn't it? In the forefront of your mind, just a gentle reminder of why you ain't coming back, why you ain't going back, coming back, looking back. You are moving forward and I love you. Listen. I encourage you, continue to come in with discernment and or your intuition. That way you will know what applies to you and what you need to apply to yourself and hold yourself accountable to by way of your own personal spiritual situation. But if it don't apply, baby, the wisest thing I can tell you is just let it fly. Lay it down easy peasy, nice and greasy, baby. Leave it for somebody else to take. Like, share, and subscribe if you like my vibe, or maybe you'll watch the video in its entirety to determine what it is that you want to do. Whatever it is, listen, I support you in the energy. If you're returning back to the channel, then you are my beautiful, amazing Soul Tribe family. I love you and you love me. We are a beautiful, radiant, happy Soul Tribe family. Listen, with a great big kiss. And a hug from me to you, won't you say, happy to, 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 happy to, 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 happy to, to, happy to, to, happy to, to, to you hey that was so cheesy that was so greasy that was so good i love y'all <laughs> i love you so much listen come on in here and get this spiritual work baby what's good tell me what's good and i'll tell you what's incredible tell me what's incredible i'll tell you what's great listen you, i feel like i got the spiritual bars today shout out to the person that told me that was slick rick i knew that was slick rick on the last video you know when i was rapping okay <laughs> it reminds me of fab five freddy on saturday mornings or was that friday nights he came on one of those days they might have switched it up okay and uh i used to watch all the new videos on cable yo mtv raps in compton right watching all the east coast rappers yeah listen come on to get this spiritual work shout out to you i see you love and light i love you soul tribe what's good what's going on on the 222 spirit hermit okay okay virgo energy virgo energy purifying yourself going within so you don't have to go without you can do that on any day 222 223 224 whenever yeah listen judgments here it's a fair judgment for us you know this is beautiful when i see the judgment in the upright that's like the universe saying all things are being made fair okay show me what else i need to see please and thank you strength leo energy power standing in your power oh oh leo energy somebody's birthday's in august okay you either august virgo or uh, august leo this is heavy energy okay or if you just have this anywhere in your chart, or if it just resonates with you, maybe you're embodying earth and fire. Okay. Queen of Wands, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. I can't make it up. What's good though? What's going on here? Heavy on the Leo energy then. Okay. Fire sign energy. But somebody's got earth and fire in their chart. Oh Lord, what's going on in the 222? Two, two, two? Okay. We got 10 here. That's a nice round number. Betrayal. Everything is fine. Ten of Swords. I just heard they wanted to take you out. Oh, okay. Like out to dinner or out to <laughs> like, where are we going? Or somebody was trying to take you out. 
Like, tu fini you? Like, adios you? Arrivederci you? Like, what do you mean? Como se dice? What do you mean? Yeah, trying to take you out, spirit guys. What does that mean? Take me out where? To the park? <laughs> I'm like, I like long walks with my... To the bank, 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 bank. <laughs> no, my friend, listen. They was trying to take you out, trying to make you crazy in your cabeza. Loco on your cabeza. Somebody was trying to make you crazy. Now they crazy? Okay. Yeah, somebody was trying to take you out. And you in that East Coast rap mode, you like, don't try to play me out. Don't try to play me out. Listen, what you talking about? Three of swords. Okay, I'm being guided to take it. Spirit says take it. Something about a new beginning, a miracle. Okay, well, listen. Why these people don't go get their own miracles? What's, oh, that's right. They don't have no power. I just did a video on them losing all their power. Okay, so this explains everything. Listen, yeah, your ancestors stood up. Okay, this is giving me like, yeah, somebody's watching you be celebrated. Seven of Wands. They know that you're real spiritually protected. So why are they still trying? What do they want? Uh, that made my face itch. <laughs> I'm like, oh, hold on. Let me scratch my face. Because this is ridiculous. Nine of Swords. Who is this? Listen, can we just have a commercial break? Shout out to all my high vibrational Leos and Virgos. I love y'all so much. Y'all are radiant, amazing. I got a lot of Leo and or Virgo in my chart. Listen, okay, but what is going on? Who is this? Judgment, Libra, Scorpionic energy, death. Somebody could really be like going down for something they tried to do to you because you're financially independent. You're coming up as the queen of pentacles towards Virgo Capricorn. Okay, something about you moving forward, something about travel, Queen of Cups energy, somebody's mad, somebody's at a distance hating from you this far. Somebody's like far, far away. Like, how you hating from way over there? <laughs> you ain't got nothing to do over there? Like, what? Go walk the dog or something. Listen, I love Leo's and Virgo's high vibrational. I love it when I sing Virgo, la, 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 my beautiful Leos. You got somebody mad because you just too loving life for them. You got a shadow. You know how to get it popping. Okay. But you left somebody to shadow box with themselves. Aquarius energy, star quality, platform. Somebody's on a platform. This could be me. This could be you. This could be all of us, star seeds, or somebody else is on a platform and they watching and they mad. They watching you get to the bag and the ace of cups. And listen, this is your blessing. The ace of cups is like my cup overflow. Look, seven of pentacles. I mean, what is this here? I mean, seven of swords, sneaky and deceptive. Nine of pentacles, Virgo energy. What do they want? Oh my God. You just keep transmuting it. Now somebody's stressed out, can't sleep at night. What is going on? Clarify this star and this person. <laughs> like, I'm like happy to, 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 to. Yeah, toiling labor. Somebody's in the public eye. Something that you do for work that you're, listen, whatever this is, it's good. The star to the eight of pentacles is something like something what you do for work. So somebody's in some type of competitive effort. Yeah, they're competing with you. Hold on. Let me show. I love showing the cards because the cards are just so nice. Ace of wands, new business, new endeavor. You could have a new platform. Okay. They want to weigh you down. They want you stressed out. They want your edges to fall out. Meanwhile, you know, you're doing real good and, and things are not looking good. Show me this person. Let's just expose them. Okay. Because if they made it here to spirit report, then the universe is tired of that ass. Okay. Yeah. They're coming in as a fake ass friend. This is a friend of me, friend, friend, friend. Hey, friend. And all the while they trying to put 10 of these swords all in your back, all up your spine. Listen. Mm, mm, mm. I just heard Miss Mary Mac, 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 all dressed in black, 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 with silver buttons, 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 all down her back, back. In this case, swords all down somebody's back. Yeah, listen, nine of cups. The young people are like, who? <laughs> 
Miss Mary whom? <laughs> Nine of Cups because your wishes are being fulfilled? What is the deal? Oh, God. Clarify what we need to do. Somebody's like watching your wishes get fulfilled. Ancestors. Yeah. Somebody's a fake ass friend. Somebody's a fake friend. This wanted to come out upside down. So somebody's a friend of me. They could have a platform as well. Or maybe they're just watching you work in the public eye with the star to the eight of pentacles. And the nine of cups getting your wishes fulfilled. Nine of cups is a fake phony friend. Somebody wanted you heartbroken, uh, stressed out, betrayed. Whatever this is, you're coming off very, very attractive. Okay. Mm, what does this person want? They don't like the fact that people keep giving to you. They want to apologize. They want to apologize. Somebody did some type of work. Yeah, now they're abandoning the situation. They wanted to confuse you, but you know who this person is. Yeah, the sun, Leo energy, you illuminated something. Ace of Pentacles about your new beginning. Somebody is mad. They were watching. Okay, somebody wanted you mentally stressed out. There's Nine of Swords to the Ten of Swords with the Four of Swords. Somebody wanted you mentally gone. And Three of Swords. They wanted you just heartbroken. All the while, you transmuted the heck out of that energy with love and light. Six of Swords is like healing. Somebody's spying and watching. Somebody's got a lot of fire in their chart. Okay, yeah. Silent competition. Five of Wands. Unnecessary battle. Hmm. Hmm. What exactly is going on here? <laughs> Just like two, two, two is so good. I'm like, oh, okay. You still out here doing this. Okay. Well, you know, somebody's got to do it. Yeah. The Empress energy, Libra energy. Let's just clarify why. Clarify that Empress energy, please. And thank you, Holy Spirit. I just heard this could be a group of people. Yeah, you were guided to protect your energy. And so something that you did by way of transmuting something, back somebody's ass all the way up. I just heard they want your gifts and they want your power. Two of Cups, Gemini energy, Libra energy. This is you. They don't like the way people are giving to you, loving on you, Queen of Pentacles. You're coming out very independent, financially independent, and they don't like it. Ooh, we. This is a lot of evil eye, unnecessary. You're protected, though. Nine of Wands, somebody don't like the fact that you're protected from this attack. You stood up for yourself. So something that you did, you could have transmuted the energy or returned it to sender. Something got somebody trapped and bound. To something that they did though eight of swords oh we clarify that please and thank you holy spirit yeah somebody can't move forward so somebody didn't want you to move forward and now they can't move forward somebody doesn't want you to get an offer from somebody either the chariot in reverse clarify that chariot in reverse somebody wanted a tower Page of Wands. Yeah, somebody's getting news that you're still getting your fortune, though. Somebody's getting news, honey. They even tried to make a child sick. They're watching. Somebody doesn't even know what they're seeing. They're just watching. Will of Fortune. They want to make you angry. They want to fight. They want energy. They want attention. And you're ignoring them, starving, that, starving them out. My nose is itching. You're starving somebody out. I just keep hearing, don't try to play me out. Don't try to play me out. Wheel of Fortune. Page of Wands. Okay. They could have tried to make a child of yours sick. Getting news or something like that. They just tried to do everything. I feel like they purposely tried to piss you off. Like make you angry. You know, anything to get some type of attention from you. But the Page of Swords is like them just watching. What they? What are they looking at? Are they watching right now? Hi. <laughs> hey hi <laughs> happy to 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 yeah somebody did magic fell right on top of the queen of pentacles so whoever this uh leo virgo is possibly or virgo leo whatever this is 
Somebody is uh, doing magic over somebody's stability. It fell right on top of the queen. Yeah, listen. Trying to hold you back from something that you do for work, okay? The star to the eight of pentacles with the Hierophant Taurus energy. You are absolutely a reader. The star, eight of pentacles, okay? The Hierophant Somebody attacked the divine one, honey. And you keep getting the nine of cups. The more, I just heard the more they hex you, the more they try to curse you, the more you get blessed. What? The wheel of fortune. Four of pentacles. They was trying to get you to like be in this impoverished pover, I can't even say the word because God forbid, I don't want to speak that in my life. The P word. <laughs> Words have power. So, you know, yeah, they wanted you within the four of pentacles, like in this lack mindset, basically. God forbid it. Rebuke it. I don't even like saying it. Like saying it makes me feel a little uncomfortable. You know why? Because all of our needs are met all the time. Temperance is here. You're a whole earth angel. Archangel Michael came out and whooped somebody's ass, honey. Yeah, you're coming up as a high priestess. Who the hell are these weird-ass people? A truth teller. Ace of swords are being guided to take it. Look at this energy. This is you, divine one. Okay, somebody tried it. What a dumb, da da dumb, da dum dum da dum da da dum da da dum da dum The star, eight of pentacles, the hierophant to the high priestess, and the ace of swords is a truth teller. This is somebody that tells the truth, the whole truth, and nothing but the truth. You work for the divine. You're so high ranked that this is like, you know, somebody bringing a butter knife to a machete fight. It's like, you know, a chihuahua trying to fight a pit bull. It's a goon to a goblin. What is this? Okay. Okie dokie. Listen. Yeah, look. And they think they slick. Who are they? What are they doing? Seven of Swords, this could be more than one person. Clarify the Seven of Swords and the Five of Wands. Yeah, justice, Libra and energy. Things have to be balanced out. Somebody's getting that ass waxed. Damn, you know what's so crazy? I just heard they don't have enough power to fight back. This is what happens when you give up all that power. Yeah. Somebody was doing some type of illusions, mental magic. Seven of Cups with the Magician and the Nine of Swords. Somebody wanted you to be like, oh, I hear voices. Oh, I don't know. You a whole evolved master out here. <laughs> You're a master. You are an ascended master walking the earth. I just heard you're not even from this world. Something about alien DNA, you can't be killed. What? Did they know this before they did this? Or they just was trying this for shits and giggles? Because ain't nobody laughing. What's going on? That's my thing. The Hierophant, the High Priestess to the Star, Eight of Pit. What? Child. Trying to do magic like that on a high-ranked spiritual gangster. What in the world were these people thinking? They weren't. I just heard the energy pass right through you. And then you churned it and turned it into light. And then you took the light. <laughs> you mean to tell me you took pitch black, let there be light, let there be dark type of an energy. Churned it, turned it, and then kept it for yourself. You said, thank you. wanted you in your head thinking thinking oh my god it's happening again oh my god where when is it gonna stop well, don't you ever speak no weird ass shit like that over yourself okay so it's clear and it's more than obvious temperance to the king of wands somebody's a sagittarius this just fell right on sagittarius okay listen whatever this is king of wands please honey i i can't even say please it's over the universe is saying sit down Mm -hmm. somebody likes giving up all their power somebody wanted to create a cord like 
You know how you go fishing? Do people still go fishing? I'm a, I'm a fishing type of person. I haven't been since I was a child. Shout out to my grandmother, rest in peace, Lucy Ellen. <laughs> she was so little and skinny, but she carried that 22, baby. She'll shoot you before, before you even got anything ruled out. She was a Taurus. May the 5th or May 3rd. Oh, I do apologize. Listen. But fishing, that's what I was thinking, okay? Fishing, I went on a tangent. It was necessary. Sometimes I need that in spiritual court. But yes, I see somebody like throwing a line like three fingers or throwing energy with three fingers. That's creative. Is that like magician? Like, what is that? <laughs> that reminds me of like Harry Potter. Somebody's like throwing a line. I see somebody throwing a line, trying to attach it to you so they can call power in. Yeah, but it's not catching. You ain't got no bait on the end of that hook because you spent all your money on on, on bullshit. Wasting your time. <laughs> Page of Pentacles. <laughs> You're getting good news about money. So somebody wants to tie into your abundance. This could be somebody separate. Okay. This could be a this could be, yeah. This could be, yeah. This is you, Divine One. You're abundant. Ten of Pentacles is wealth, wealth, money on top of money, 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 coming in, coming in. Something that you do for work, something that you do very well. You get paid very, very well. Okay. I just heard money, money is attracted to me. It come around like honey, honey, cause I'm fly like a bee. Yeah, somebody knows that you're abundant, baby. They know that you're abundant, but if you're abundant, then what are they? Because apparently they don't have no power. They don't believe in themselves. Yeah, you believe in yourself. The fool represents faith, the evidence of faith. You're manifesting. Somebody's projecting, but they don't have no more power. You know, why would you just keep your power to try to get right and heal? And then maybe you could have your own Ten of Pentacles. But see, that would be too much like right. That's how we think, Divine Ones. Yeah, somebody is, <clears throat> excuse me, somebody's mad about your new beginning. Somebody's upset about this new beginning. I mean, they're fighting tooth and nail with all they have in them. Somebody's fighting to the death, and so death shall it be upon your enemy's heads. They've been confounded and put to shame, and they've been turned backwards. You know they feed her on backwards. They've been defeated. Listen, they better be glad they still got their feet. Even though your feet are on backwards, and you got two left feet, and they tied together. <laughs> Every time you try to run forward, you actually run backwards. Listen, you better thank God you still got your damn feet at this point. Because somebody about to lose their feet too. Ankles and legs. Listen, five of swords. Child fighting you to the end, honey. Somebody just can't see it happen. <coughs> Giving up all they little bit of power. Ten of cups. <laughs> Clarify the Ten of Cups, Holy Spirit, my beautiful angels. Yeah, because you got some coming in. It's always some new, new on the horizon. So listen, let's just break it down on a real commercial break. You are a star. You are on the public platform. Whatever you do for work, you get paid very, very well. You are a star. This is your destiny. You're aligned with your destiny, okay? Let's just be clear. You got the will of fortune. Good things are coming in. So you're getting abundance on top of abundance. Money, 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 money. Not only that, you are a high-ranked spiritual practitioner, the higher font, okay? You could be a, somebody that does divination. Um, I just heard somebody that creates candles or something like that. Or maybe you do candle work or pray for people. Something that's real divine here with the higher font and the high priestess, okay? They did magic over you, mental magic with the magician and the seven of cups to the nine of swords, projecting onto you conflict, anger all this stuff you took it you transmuted it you showed me said listen this is how you do it <laughs> you told him get your puck ass up from down there messing with all that dirt and 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 and, and, <laughs> and hanging out in the graveyard and you went and you took whatever they sent to you and you turned it and you churned it because you are the alchemist you're the master I am the master alchemist. I am the master magician. And you kept all the power for yourself. And now somebody is sore. Somebody's butt hurt. Okay. Somebody's a sore ass. Somebody's sour. Okay. Well, you know, there's a stench coming up off that energy of which I do not want to engulf my senses. 
but you got the Ten of Cups. We're going to definitely engulf our senses in this Ten of Cups and this new emperor that you got coming in because somebody's pissed off. Okay. So, well, I mean, at least we know, you know, what, what it was all about. <laughs> you do the hokey pokey and you turn yourself around. You turn these people around, honey. And that's what it's all about. Hokey pokey. Meanwhile, you manifested the emperor and the empress energy. That's been coming up a lot with the two, 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 two. That's been coming up so much with the two, 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 two. Yeah. I wonder if I got somebody coming in. Ooh, the ace of pentacles. Maybe I do. Maybe I do. Where is he? I hope he smells good. King of Cups. Okay, Neff. <laughs> Show us what we need to see for the divine collective. This is not about me. It's all about you. And here's what's so funny because my spirit guy's got a nice sense of humor. The king of cups still came out after me shuffling the deck. The universe was like, yes, you're going to joke yourself right into a divine union with your perfect match. But listen, here's the funny part. I'm already in a divine union with myself. That's what makes this all so beautiful. You're already happy. You're happy. Yeah, you're like, I'm happy. Leave us alone. You want to argue. Listen, I can't argue with you. Five of Wands, sit your punk ass up out of here. Seven of Swords, sit your punk ass down. You little clown. Listen, they almost made me freestyle rap. I, I ain't gonna do it today. I'm gonna save it. I'm gonna save all my energy. Yeah, Six of Cups. Whatever you got coming in. You know what's so interesting is whoever you're going into a union with, you have a, a past life soul contract with them that's continuing in this life. I just heard no matter where this person goes, you two always find each other. That's beautiful. And whoever this is from the past past in this particular life, you had a contract with them too. Whatever it is, the cycle's closed. It's over. They need to go to sleep. Yeah, Mr. Knight of Wands. Listen, they always come up as a king of wands on the surface, but this is a knight, honey. Somebody lustful, greedy, manipulative, trying to stop you, two people, two of wands from coming together, from you making a decision, and they're way down about it. Well, I think what's mostly weighing this person down is that it's over. That's number one. The cycle's closed. Did I not just say, here's the door. Adios, Adivadelchi, nail it shut. I think what's really overwhelming this person or these people or whatever this energy is, whoever this applies to, I think what's wearing this person out and somebody else, this could be a couple, this could be several people, but there's two in particular. There's absolutely a queen of wands, Virgo, Leo, and there's a Sagittarius for sure. They could be working together. They could be a couple. Maybe this, I don't know what this is, but whatever it is, um, they absolutely are karmic soulmates. They're soulmates. Yeah, they're learning lessons, okay? But who you're going to be with, this is your divine soulmate. So everybody's with their soulmate. Everybody's getting what it is that they deserve. Okay, what does that mean? Well, the person they're with is who they're supposed to be with, but they keep sending out bullshit. Maybe because there's no, I don't know. Nothing good going on. Three of Pentacles. They could be cheating on each other. This is current energy. Seven of Pentacles. Yeah. King of Pentacles. Somebody's watching you be independent. Queen of Pentacles is already there. So whoever your person is, they're just as independent as you. Just as smart, business-wise, savvy. Clarify that for me, please, and thank you. Two of Swords. New beginning. The Tower. Yeah, somebody wants you to walk away from somebody that's your person. Somebody's doing like a lot of mind magic. A lot of weird, a lot of weird mind tricks or whatever they got going on. GI mind tricks and Jedi mind tricks or what do you call it? <laughs> Two of swords. It's about a decision that needs to be made. <clears throat> Excuse me. Ace of Cups is the new beginning that's going to happen no matter what. That's just what it is. And the tower on 222 is what these people will be getting. They should have stayed focused because your ancestors honestly are out for blood. All you got to do is continue to walk. Five of cups. Somebody's going to lose somebody and somebody's not going to make it. <clears throat> Excuse me. Throat chakra energy. Three of wands. You, these people, you left these people behind. They're obsessed. 
they're obsessed, very toxic, very toxic people. A woman and a man, four of cups, they're sore losers. They're losing everything. I feel like you were always something in between them. I just heard in between the sheets. Yeah. But now you have elevated. So you could have left somebody behind and now you're elevating. But somebody else is, is um out here in the public eye. Let's pull that energy. Because I pulled that at first and then it shifted to whoever this ex-person is. It seems like they just want to... um. <clears throat> <clears throat> excuse me it's like they just want to inject themselves in your reading like you're not concerned about this person but this first person is somebody that could be competing with you in the public eye okay it could be a leo could be a taurus could be a libra or all three okay if you're in the public eye even if you're just starting whatever this is you have a certain je ne sais quoi about you, something that is very becoming, okay, that somebody wants to um, stop people from seeing, okay, is what I'm getting. Like somebody wants to stop people from liking you, seeing you in a true light. Let me just pull more on that energy. <clears throat> Excuse me. I feel like I, somebody might have tried to send me a little something. Let me just transmute it. Hold on. Let's transmute it together. Get out of here. <laughs> and then I hold the energy for myself. This is how I transmute like, thank you. <laughs> ah, you silly little rabbits. We're the new elders. We're the new ancestors. We're the new ascended masters. Listen, don't like it? Talk to the higher ups. Oh, I'm sorry. You don't have any power. Oh, I'm sorry. But I'm not sorry that you lost your keys. Listen. <laughs> yeah, somebody didn't like that little truth coming out. I'm like, <clears throat> I didn't clear my throat a little too many times. Me, 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 me. So try. Okay. Throat chakra is clear. Okay, back from the commercial break. 32222, just as I said that. Catch the synchronicity. Come on, let's get in the flow with the spiritual work. So let's just clarify. Little Mr. What's his name in the public eye? Or Little Miss, what's her name? I just heard Tallywhacker. Scallywagger, okay, molly whopping. They molly whopping around. This is the thing, you know, just on a real commercial break. One thing I don't do, I don't look in nobody else's yard. If I like you, I like you. If I don't, then it's probably because you gave me a reason not to. But just to come out the gate and be like, oh, I don't like her. Why she got a thousand, a hundred thousand followers? Why she like that's a waste of time and energy. You cannot manifest by way of fear. That's fear, right? Prime example, you come across somebody, they got 1.2 million subscribers and you just start now. You got 50 subscribers, right? And you see somebody giving the one with the 1.2 million, you know, the evil eye. You know what you're saying to the universe? That you're afraid that you don't believe that what God is doing for that person, God can do for you. That's the type of person you're supposed to take note from. Do y'all know before I came to the platform, I looked at the people that were successful doing what it is that I wanted to do. Not only that, I respected their work because one thing that I sensed was that they were in alignment with their purpose. It was genuine work, right? All they were doing was being of service and then it came, build it and it will come, right? Go within so you don't have to go without. And then it happened, right? But if you're coming in because you want to compete with somebody or you don't like the fact that they only been around six months and you've been around eight years and they got more followers than you, then there's something that you need to recalibrate or maybe your intentions are off because the universe reads energy. Especially in 2024, baby, the universe is reading energy. Show me this wicked ass scallywag out here trying to act like they on the platform and jealous. <laughs> Soul tribe. These cards will never lie. The tower. Scorpio.
scorpionic energy i like scorpios who is this person why don't you go heal because you about to get your ass molly walked by the universe boo you about to get smashed and 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 and, and just redirected my love the tower who is this person even if they're not a Scorpio, okay, well, they don't even want to have a conversation. They're like, never mind. Who is this person? The universe is like, forget about it. <laughs> they just walked away. You in a whole eight of cups. Adios, arrivederci. I don't feel like this person is walking away on their own free will. <laughs> I think they're being uh, snatched up and or stomped out by the universe is what I think. Even if they're not a Scorpio, somebody's catching a tower currently as we speak. This is current energy. The emperor energy. Somebody's a leader. Somebody does what they... Yeah, solid competition. Quit counting people money. Quit this. Stop this. Ah, 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 ah. This is what it looks like when not staying in your lane. Okay? All you have to do is stay in your lane. Not staying in your lane goes wrong. Veer your ass right on over. Just drive your life, your car, your whatever, your energy right on back into your lane to be in alignment. Somebody all in your lane. They driving. They like, oh, your car looks nice. Your lane looks shinier than mine. Get your ass back over there. And you wonder why you hit a tree. You wonder why you hit a brick wall. Listen, because you're too busy watching somebody else's stuff. Yeah. Eight of wands. Listen, this is several people, Spirit is saying, in the public eye, or whatever this is, or people watching you. This could be people on other platforms, or this could just be people watching you in the public eye. Eight of Wands is like a swift action, quick, sneaky, you know, trying to stop you, block you, giving you evil eye real quick and hurrying up and running off because they know your ancestors are watching and can see them and or can hear every thought they have, every intention. Not a Wands, okay? Whoever this fire sign is, baby, you need to get your life together. And that's real. Could be somebody born in November too, okay? So there's a fire sign, fire sign out here. There's a Libra now here. There's a Virgo. There's a September Libra, Virgo, Virgo, Libra. There's an August Libra, um, August Leo, excuse me. Virgo is what I'm getting by way of intuitive downloads. And there's a November Scorpio out here too. Somebody's birthday is in August, okay? Number eight, eight of wands, eight of cups. You better eight of cups your eight of wands ass back to August, child, and get back in your lane. <laughs> That's going to be your best bet. Because right now, the fact that you wanted to stay in somebody else's lane is bringing you a tower. So now you have no lane. Yeah. Spirit's telling me who everybody is, not a wands. This could be an old person that's watching you, a lover, whatever this is. They're flighty. they promiscuous, weird ass. They're trying to come in, but they can't. The tower is blocking any operations and or endeavors that they want to have with you or evil eye, whatever. Eight of cups, everybody walking away. It's like scattering. It's like your enemy, you will see your enemy flee from you seven ways. 10,000 at your right hand. Ain't that what it say? That's a promise from the creator. Yeah, and that's exactly what's happening. Queen of Swords. Aquarius, Libra, and or Gemini, heavy on the Libra energy though, okay? Because I said Libra before it happened. Somebody was cold-hearted. Somebody thought they was a cat's meow and the dog's mother freaking bow wow. Coming out the gate with this sword, thinking that they could just come and do anything. No, boo-boo. No, my love. There's laws. This is why we got spiritual court, boo. Even if people don't understand the purpose of my platform, that ain't got nothing to do, do with me. I'm not here to stroke nobody's emotions and damn sure ain't here to, to cater to their egos, right? So we got spiritual court. Why? Because this is my spot. This is what I'm here to do. It's what the Most High told me. So even if somebody doesn't understand that, that's not your problem, right? What happens is when people have a problem with who you are, what you're wearing, what you're doing, how you're talking, right? More than they're concerned with their own lane, they look like fools. The whole time somebody peeking over the gate, they got a whole tower in their yard. Child, you too concerned with the wrong stuff. Show me all the adversaries. Yeah, they're under judgment. Heavy on the Scorpio and Libra energy. Somebody's absolutely a Scorpio or a Libra out here. And that sucks, y'all, because I love Scorpios in high vibration. Hold up. The Phoenix Rising Scorpios are my favorite. Okay, now if you're still in Scorpio 
low vibrational, revengeful, competitive, you know, you hurt behind something that somebody didn't inflict a wound on you on and now you're just projecting that onto somebody else because they're in their purpose, they're in alignment and you got a lot of work to do. But this is the thing, the universe is going to make sure that it happens because you're losing everything. This is like no more chances. When I see the tower with the judgment, eight of cups, ain't no walking away to try to piece up your life. It's done. The universe is going to take everything away from you because you weren't grateful for what it was that you had. You wanted to covet somebody else's blessings. Too busy peeking. Oh, she bougie. She ain't got it like that. She to act like she got money. Let me pull the cards on her. And all the while, the cards is confusing the shit out of you. You know why? Because you didn't have no business trying to look into somebody else's life. Now you look stupid because you got a whole tower behind you, on top of you, in front of you, and to the left and the right, the back and the front. The left and the right and the back and the front. Hey, left, right, and back and front. <laughs> Too busy trying to figure out what somebody got going on. Leave people alone. Oh, she must be a queen of cups. Oh, she's coming out as queen of wands. Oh, she must be a king of cups. Uh, shut your ass up. I ain't never seen nobody so preoccupied. Oh, I have, but not to this capacity. These are other content creators. The hangman, Piscean energy. Yeah, universe is sitting their ass down. Oh, now you want to see the truth? You wasn't seeing the truth when you was working with that dark ass gin that you can't get out your room now. What, well, what's the problem? What, what's going on? Cast that damn gin into a dry place. What's good? Now what? <laughs> I'll tell you what. The divine collective is too happy, baby. Too blessed to be stressed. And any stress that we have, baby, we just simply transmute that shit and keep it for ourselves. Why? Because we're the real high priestesses. This is what real high priestess do, honey. We don't go looking for people. and, and No, we support one another. When I come across... A good content creator, y'all. And I just started looking at other videos when they come up on my thread. So if you see somebody posted on my community tab, you best believe I feel as though they are great. They have talent. They have great potential. Or something resonated with me. Or maybe it's all of the above. We all have great potential. I have potential to be greater. It's not to minimize what anybody else is doing by any means. Oh, she only has 500 followers. Oh, this person got 60,000 followers. It doesn't matter. It's the energy for me. I read energy. I don't read color. I don't read, uh, you know, oh, you got a, a nice nails or your hair look good. No, I read the spirit. These things are just fun. You know, it's playing dress up. You know, the world is a stage. Everybody plays their part. What part you play is totally up to you. Just be sure that you're supporting yourself in the energy. Because when the tower comes, you know, they love to get that, huh, what, when, why? That weird ass spiritual amnesia. Huh, death spell? Me? No. Oh, well, why is death at your door then, boo? If you didn't do the death spell, <laughs> you better blame it on that spirit that's possessing you. King of Wands. Still, somebody's missing. Whoever got a King of Wands out here, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, okay? I'm getting platform content creators. I'm getting ex-lovers. I'm getting, yeah, people from your family. Look, whoever these people are, listen. I don't think praying for them at this point is going to even matter. I'm going to be honest. I don't believe that it's going to benefit you to squander your pearls and, and, and cast them onto swine. I don't. Your prayers are precious. I do not believe that. From what I'm saying, look, Ten of Cups. These are people that want to go with you. I want to go. You're like, no, you can't go. You don't go well with my spiritual outfit. I'm high vibrational. Ten of Cups. Yeah, somebody too busy. Too busy trying to see what you got going on. Ten of Wands trying to weigh somebody down. Now they weigh down. Clarify anything else? Yeah, Spirit says what I'm saying is the truth. And the fact that you're a truth teller really got somebody's ass pissed off. Anything else, Spirit? Yeah, somebody, somebody is... <laughs> 44-44. That's all I got to say about that.
somebody, a lot of people keep sending death. Now, just like you, you have the power to transmute energy. When they had enough power to transmute energy, they chose not to. They chose to keep sending you negative energy because they just couldn't live with the fact that you are who God says that you are. So now, here they are with no power. Ten of Wands is like Ten of Swords, bottoming out, tired, devastating endings, ain't got no energy, no nothing, no money, no resources, no Roger, no rent. <laughs> okay? Now they don't have no energy to transmute a damn thing. So you let something backfire, and you know who's making the decision based on what backfires? The Lord. The Lord says, vengeance is mine. Because you're transmuting it. You don't have time to be caught in this little weird ass space of jealousy and evil eye. Who the hell got time for that? There's people out here that need to be helped. There's spiritual journeys that are like, yeah, like, what are you doing? Nobody has time for that. So you're simply transmuting the energy, right? Okay, well, listen. Now they ain't got no power to send. Somebody just throwing little darts of energy. They don't even know, like sprinkles. Like, if you don't keep that little sprinkle for yourself, <laughs> You about to sprinkle yourself to death. The star. You're still the star. This is your destiny. So right now the universe is putting everything in alignment for you. Somebody's angry about that. They wanted you to be in the five of pentacles. It ain't going to happen. And all doors to whatever they're trying to do is closed. They can't get their power back. The star. You are the star. Five of pentacles. These people are struggling financially. They could have wanted you to be in poverty. But you're not. Anybody trying to pull cards on you, I just heard it's confused. This is what's really got them confused. Yeah. So somebody was like trying to like tap into your energy and they weren't authorized. You know, um, your ancestors played a trick on them. The gatekeeper tricked them, trickster energy to teach them a lesson for trying to pull cards. They could have been pulling death, the tower, ten of wands, ten of swords, judgment, all these dark energies, but little did they realize they were ab absolutely looking at, excuse me, their own fate. So then you show up, good morning. They're like, what? <laughs> we just saw you in the five of it. Like, no, boo, that's your destiny. That's the only person's energy or the lack thereof because y'all ain't got no energy. Energies don't do this. Real spiritual G's, we don't do shit like this. We can, but why? So the only power that you have, like I said, and I'm saying that facetiously because I see people powerless, that they can tap into is their own fate. So whenever they're pulling the cards, that's them. Somebody was pulling the cards though and seeing your true future. Three of Wands, they were seeing what was at the distance. The sun and the new beginning. And this is why they're mad. Trying to hold you back from something good. They're like, oh, shoot. She got a man that's about to come in and give her a ten and a half carat. What? He got a woman that's coming in as a real high priestess. What? And they both the king of pentacles. I can't. Well, you know, you, you can, but you can't. And you will and you won't. You shall and you shan't now. Now the decision has been made. You absolutely cannot. Should have made that decision when you was in that I can energy. <laughs> or I will. <laughs> Temperance. This is the message. The cards are repeating themselves. And you know what? It's just spiritual shenanigans. <laughs> Maybe I'll name the video. What in the spiritual shenanigans is going on here? Congratulations, y'all. Y'all just watched a title be born. This is how I get the titles. I'm telling you, these are real downloads. So when y'all see those titles, I'm laughing just like y'all. They come from my spirit team. It was one that I had that I just laughed so hard. I pray about what the titles are supposed to be. I pray about everything, okay? One of them was, your enemies are shaking in their raggedy ass karmic boots. I hollered so bad. 
and so good. <laughs> but this is going to be, what in the shenanigans is going on here? Nothing. Not a damn thing. Not a damn thing. Let them. Let them. They got a sprinkle, a tinkle, a little tt tinkle of energy that they holding on to by a thread. And everybody's feeding off the same little drop of energy. It's over. This is the message, though. I love y'all. I really do. I really, really do. If you like to donate to the channel, then listen, just go ahead and do it. I'll receive it with love and light. May the most high bless you times 10 times 10 times 10. Make sure if you sow, if you send a dollar or if you send a hundred dollars, if you send a thousand dollars, if you send 10,000, 43,000, 65,000, whatever you send, make sure you do it from a place, right, of gratitude. Do not give in fear. That's just a kind reminder. I think we already know that, Right. Even if you're just sowing love and light, maybe you're sending me love and light, do it in a way that you would do it for yourself. That's how I give. I love giving y'all. That's why I need a lot more because I have people to give to. I'm so excited. I just love seeing, seeing people like, you know, everybody have what they need. I'm like, okay, listen, you got what you need. You got what I need. I got what I need. Okay. Yeah. But these scallywags, oh, they couldn't touch your energy with a with a 10-foot pole and a two-foot pole. Cause they four inches from uh, the floor. Listen, I love you though. I really do. I'll see you in the next video. Peace be with you.